All right guys, welcome back to another video. So I got a really cool house here for you today. Kind of looks like a mansion from the outside, but once you get inside, you realize it's not really that big. I mean, it's still a really big home, but I don't know if I call it a mansion. Maybe if I could get into the basement, but unfortunately the basement's flooded. So I'm not entirely sure I would call it that, but either way, it's a fairly modern home. I don't know why it was abandoned. Maybe it's for development or maybe because the basement flooded, who knows, but it looks like it's been abandoned for a while. And I know I was here like two or three years ago, so it's been abandoned at least that long. I just don't know any of the story about it, but I think you guys are really gonna like this one. So let's check out this static space. All right, guys. Wow, we got a really big main bathroom here. This thing is huge. Lots of space. Look at this tile. Everywhere but the ceiling. And we've got the uh, his and her sinks, of course. Looks kind of 80s. So I'm guessing that's when this house was built, likely. Not sure, I'll have to find out after the fact. Got a really green room here. Wow, it's really green. It's nice to see color though, I must admit. This house is, yeah, pretty much empty, but what I like about it is it's, it's fairly large and these colorful rooms are actually pretty cool. I don't know why when I first found this place originally, I guess I just didn't like it, but I didn't take any photos, just a few cell shots. Plus I was parked in the driveway and that's never a good thing. So that probably didn't help matters at all. But yeah, we got the pink room here. And now let's head over to the blue room. Pink, blue, and green. So almost RGB. I don't know, this house still has a meter, but yeah, it doesn't have power. There's no way. I mean, the basement's flooded, right? So there's just no way. All right. We've seen those bedrooms. Now let's check out the master bedroom. Well, first, we got something over here. Got a closet. There's access to the attic, I guess. And here's another smaller bathroom. This one just has a shower where the other one just had a tub. Actually, it may have had a shower as well, but yeah. So I guess this is part of the, the master. Yeah, this is the ensuite bathroom for the, the master bedroom. So here is the master bedroom. Got an incredible view outside there. Wow, what a nice view. And when I came into this room initially, bird flew out of here, here's his nest. So, I want to get out of this area as quickly as possible, I guess. Probably stressing them out. But this is weird. This is like another room within the master bedroom. I don't really get it. Seems a bit odd. It's not a closet or anything like that. It's a whole other bedroom. So that's really strange. Look at this staircase, guys. Really nice staircase.
I don't know if this type of staircase has a particular name or not, but it's really cool. Here's the front doors. Pretty boring, if you ask me. And here's a view of the staircase from the, the ground floor. Yeah, it's really nice. So let's finish off on the staircase here. So there you can see the, the flooded basement. Actually, I may be able to go down here a little bit. I don't know, these stairs may not be safe. Hopefully they are though. Yeah, let's go down a bit further. Oh yeah. Yeah, check that out guys. Flooded basements. Such a shame. Yeah, it's what, like three or four feet deep? It's pretty deep. Ow! Damn it! Hit my head. Check out this room. Oh, it hurt. Head hurts. Yeah, just some PPE stuff here. Not sure what's going on. And oh, look at this. Got a fireplace. That's pretty nice. Definitely not one of my the favorite my favorite fireplaces, but still pretty cool. We'll go back to that kitchen in a minute. Oh, I didn't uh, get my light out. Well, you guys can kind of see. Let's get this. So here we have one of the downstairs bathrooms. Well, that's kind of cool. That shower stall. Ooh. Oh, and here's the, uh, the laundry room. All they have is a washer now in Inglis. There's an outside door. See, this is why you don't paint. <laughs> I don't know. They had a really nice brown stained wood door, solid wood door. Then they went and painted it white. And now it's all peeling off. I don't know, guys. If I had a nice wood door like that, I wouldn't paint over it. And yeah, here's the kitchen. So it's a very colorful house. <clears throat> Some updated uh, cabinetry. So yeah, this was built. I don't know when, but it's definitely been updated since, since it was built. Looks like there's new windows and stuff like that, maybe. That sort of thing. I don't know. I'll see what I can find out after the fact, guys, because I'm really curious now. This is a weird one. Nice view of the stairs from the back as well. And is this the last room? Yep, the last room. So this looks like, you know, it would have been a living room or something. Maybe the, no, living room, I think. Dining room would have, would be that other room with the fireplace. So yeah, nothing, you know, super fancy or anything like that, but it's still a pretty cool explore and I knew you guys would like it. So I knew I had to come here and check it out. Um, Let's see if we can go into the garage. Uh -huh. 
Oof. I'll film that at the end, guys. All right, guys, so here we are in the garage. It's a really cool tractor here. This thing's pretty old. It's a pretty cool find. Unbelievable. We also got a barbecue. Sorry, it's a bit dark now. Yeah, just a bunch of junk, really. A few jerry cans. Yeah, but this tractor is a great find. So cool. All right, guys, that's it. Alright guys, so I just did an outro and apparently I wasn't recording. Ah well, I'll do it again. Alright, thanks a lot for watching, really hope you enjoyed this one. I know it was a little bit plain and modern and that sort of thing, but it still had some interesting aspects to it, like this staircase is just amazing. And those colorful bedrooms upstairs, they're, they're really cool. The flood basement was interesting as well. So I did find a year of 2000 in this place, but that seems way too modern for me. I think it was probably renovated then, maybe built in the 80s. So I'll see what I can find out once I get home, and I'll let you guys know down in the description. All right, take care guys, and I'll see you at the next Static Space. But I think you guys are really, but I think you guys are really gonna like this one, so let's check it out. Oh no, was it recording? Oh no. And those colorful bedrooms upstairs, they're really cool. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So see what I can find out. Uh... Anyway, thanks a lot for watching.